There's a rhythm. We all feel it. A beat that keeps us alive. The metronome of life. Pulsing, pumping. It's all around us. The progress, the motion, the noise. We crave it and we curse it. The daily grind, the striving, the emptiness. The rhythm keeps on going and going and going. What if there's more? What if we need to skip a beat? In 1738, at a gathering of Christian believers on Aldersgate Street in London, a career priest struggling with his own faith had an experience that changed his life. His name was John Wesley. And after hearing a Christian teaching, he felt his heart strangely warmed. He'd known God intellectually, but now he knew God in his heart. Christians sometimes call this a conversion experience, an encounter with the Holy Spirit, like being born again, like skipping a beat. In the Bible, Jesus' disciples had an experience like this too at Pentecost. They had been continuing the daily grind of teaching about Jesus' death and resurrection amongst his believers. But then in one moment, it all changed. They had an encounter with the Holy Spirit, tongues of fire. They went out on the streets and started speaking in different languages, sharing the good news of Jesus. They skipped a beat and their lives were never the same. John Wesley's experience transformed his way of life and kick-started the Methodist movement that still exists today. How will God cause your heart to skip a beat?